Hey, what's up guys? It's Mike Chan with SixPackShortcuts.com. Got another killer exercise for you. Today, we're gonna be doing all chests. So, uh, you see, I picked up a bench here. Didn't have a bench at home. And, uh, you know, this is a real cheap bench. I mean, honestly, I picked this bench up at Craigslist for like 15 bucks. So, you know, it's super light and it's not the sturdiest, but, you know, it'll do. So, uh, today we're gonna do three exercises. We're gonna be doing what I call a close, a close grip dumbbell press with a pullover. I'll show you that in just a sec. Follow that by chest presses with uh, dumbbells, and then we're gonna go into push-ups. We're gonna do 12 reps each of every single exercise, and that equals one set, and we're gonna go for four sets total. Now, I'm gonna demonstrate four sets, and if you're doing this at home, I'd recommend probably doing anywhere from about seven to eight sets. Really go ahead and blast your chest. So let's get going. Let me show you how it's done. All right, so first one here, I'm starting off with a little lighter dumbbell, just so I don't, I can get, we'll go with a good form. Show you how it's done. This is a really good exercise for your middle chest. So what you want to do, hold the dumbbells together like this. You want to come in, press, and then do a pullover, just like that. Come back, press, and come back down. Really good for your inner chest, and it gets a really good stretch in your inner chest, and at the same time, bring in some lats, or basically your back. So you're gonna do 12 reps of those. Ah. Oh, these are much heavier. All right, followed by dumbbell presses. Then you're gonna do 12 reps of these. Make sure you don't have to come all the way down, but make sure you're at least at 90 degrees. Okay, and all right. then we're gonna get off the bench, come to the side, and do 12 push-ups. Okay, then that's gonna equal one set. I'm gonna demo four, you're gonna go for seven to eight. All right. Let's keep going. So this weight's kind of light for me, but didn't feel that light at the end. I'm starting to feel it burn already. So without rest, that's another thing. Without rest, go right into the second exercise. Second, uh, second set. All right. Okay. So I can feel my chest already. This is pretty good. Really, really good. Pullovers, where you come back like this. It's a really good exercise to work on your upper and inner chest. It's an awesome exercise, but not a lot of guys do it because it's more of like a it's not really like an old school exercise, it's just not very popular. I really don't know why. It's actually a really good exercise, but okay. 
So we're just combining the two together. So, down round two, two more left. And it's gonna start off with a lighter weight. Because <laughs> if I had heavier dumbbells up than those, I actually am using 15s right there, believe it or not. Super light, but not when you're doing it, it's not light. <laughs> it feels heavy. And guys, like if you're doing this, like right now, my inner chest is like burning. And the cool thing about it is, it's not burning throughout the whole chest, just like right here in the middle. So that's when you know it's working it. So if you wanna like get that line, this is an awesome, awesome workout. Feeling it for you when you do seven sets because <laughs> I'm only three sets in. It is tough. Whew. Okay. All right. Take your rest. And we got one more left. rest a little bit a little bit longer but I'm just gonna shorten it up so this way I can demonstrate the last set oh. now guys remember if you don't rest uh, if you don't rest 
long enough, your strength won't recover, which is not bad, but you just won't be able to lift as heavy. I'll so give up right now if y'all guys weren't watching. <laughs> oh. So, that was tough. So I almost changed my mind on telling you to do seven. You may want to just do four. <laughs> but uh, it's gonna be a little easier if you rest a little longer. Um, I wasn't really counting my rest times, but usually for something like this, I'll rest about a minute and a half, maybe even up to two minutes. Um, on this one, I was probably resting a little shorter, but if you want to make it more intense, rest a little shorter. We just realized, man, it's gonna be that much tougher. But really good though, because shorter rest times means you sweat like crazy, burn more calories, and it's more intense. But just remember, if you wanna build big chest, you wanna build massive muscles, you still gotta go heavy. So don't just sacrifice uh, you know, the amount of weight you lift, just go ahead, just to do more repetition, or to, uh, to uh, have shorter rest times. Make sure you lift heavy and also get your rest times, you know, about a minute and a half to two minutes so this way you have enough time to recover to lift those heavy weights and to build big muscles. So, hope you enjoy the video. More workouts, sixpackshortcuts.com. Go check it out. And uh, thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time.